All right, folks, hold on to your hats and your bananas because we're diving headfirst into the wackiest party in town, the Monkey Buffet Festival. The story behind this festival goes like this. Once upon a time in the bustling city of Lubbury, Thailand, the locals noticed something peculiar. Their city was overrun with monkeys. But these weren't just any monkeys. They were macaques believed to be descendants of the monkey king Hanuman, who helped rescue a divine prince's wife in an epic tale of Ramayana. The locals thought, these monkeys may bring good luck and prosperity. Why not throw a party? And so, the Monkey Buffet Festival was born. Every year on the last Sunday of November, the people of Laburi prepare a feast fit for monkey royalty. Imagine this, towering pyramids of watermelon, durian, lettuce, pineapple, and more. Over 4,000 kilograms of fruits, vegetables, and other treats. It's like the Oscars for monkeys, but with less speeches and more food fights. The festival kicks off with an opening ceremony that includes performances by dancers in monkey costumes. When the monkeys arrive, it's like watching a bunch of kids in a candy store. They jump across tables, climb the food towers, and indulge in the nearly two tons of offerings. It's a sight to behold. I mean, look at these little guys go. It's like they've been training for this moment their entire lives. Move over, competitive eaters. The real champions are here. Ah, the age-old battle between monkey and coconut. It's like a sitcom waiting to happen. Someone get these guys a reality show. And here we have the ultimate game of catch me if you can. It's like a high-stakes heist movie, but with bananas instead of jewels. Whoa, check out Mr. Cool Monkey over here. He's got style, he's got swagger, he's probably the most fashionable monkey in the world. You know, I've heard of party animals, but these guys take it to a whole new level. It's like the circus came to town, but instead of clowns, we've got monkeys. But the Monkey Buffet Festival isn't just about feeding monkeys. It's also a way to promote tourism and raise awareness about the importance of wildlife conservation. So while the monkeys are having the time of their lives, the humans are learning valuable lessons about coexistence and respect for nature. So if you ever find yourself in Lopri on the last Sunday of November, don't be surprised if you see a monkey sitting next to you at the dinner table. Just pass the bananas and enjoy the show. That's all for now, folks. The Monkey Buffet Festival, where the only thing crazier than the monkeys is the laughter they bring. Until next time, keep those bananas close and those smiles even closer.